dead started walking, I was small and alone. Until a man named Lee became my protector. protected other people too but he couldn't save everyone he could never save everyone the living were just as dangerous as the dead a woman in our group named Lily lost her dad and then she just couldn't cope she took the life that Lee saved Lee showed her kindness, but she took advantage of it later. Lee taught me how to survive. He protected me as long as he could, but he got bit because of me. And even in the end, he was still teaching. Lee wouldn't make it. He knew it was the end. He made one final request. He told me to leave him. And I did. I met another group after that. Broken people, running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. AJ, he made it, but the mom didn't, and I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. We thought he was gone forever. That was the last straw for Kenny, and without Lee around, I had to make the call. I stopped Kenny finally gave him peace. It turned out AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Knowing what they'd done... I still decided we were better together, for AJ's sake. But like everything else, it wouldn't last. AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. I thought we'd found something that worked, but I was wrong again. They took AJ from me, said I was too young to take care of him. I fought back, but I wasn't strong enough. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. We're searching together now for a place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. Just like Lee did for me.
you doing there, goofball? Pretending we got bullets. Well, don't. It's getting on my nerves. I don't like goofball. I'm too big for it. Oh, I've always called you goofball. It's time for you to stop. It's Alvin Jr. AJ still work? AJ still works. What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. Alvin Jr., it's me, Disco Broccoli. Word on the street is that you want to eat me. Is that true? Do you want to eat me? <laughs> Come on, Clem, I can't eat a toy. Oh man, my feelings are hurt. My stomach hurts. <laughs> Sassy. Here, practice your reading. But I don't want to. It'll take your mind off your stomach. Preheat oven place cream vanilla be beans into a saucepan and bring to a boy. Uh, on second thought, never mind. That's only gonna make you hungrier. Here you go. About all we got. What about you? Go for it. We'll find something else soon. I believe you. We gonna do it? Think so. Looks clear. We're doing it. Need water too. All right, let's find some food. Friendly, ring the bell. What does it mean? It means the people here shoot first.
What are you doing? AJ, stay back. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. Next, we get in there. used to grow things here is long gone. Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. You swing on it. For fun? You get in the tire and someone pushes you so that you go really high. Oh, I wanna try. After we clear this place. Interesting. What do we do inside a new place? We listen for monsters. After that? Uh... Come on, you remember. We... Inside a new place? We always... Uh... Check the windows? That's right. Monsters. All tied up. They can't get us? No, they can't. Hmm. Windows are all boarded up. This one's locked. Security door. Hmm. Can't pry that open. I know you're hungry. I am too. We'll find something. I promise. Would it? B. 
beans. <sighs> Homemade. Might be more where this came from. well for their last meal Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. Poison. Did they give up? They wanted to leave this world together. Holding hands in their own home. Will we have a home? We'll see. This opens the lock. <sighs> That's not happening. Do we get the key? Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. That's right. I didn't see any food out there. Too small to crawl through. Well, for me. The key or the window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill the monsters. They're not people. Well, they used to be people. And as people, they ask to be left alone. So what's best? AJ, I need your help on this one. In there? We need to know if there's food inside. And I need you to be brave. Okay, I can be brave. Lift me up. Once you're through, unlock this door. Got it. AJ! Gotta see this, Clem. <sighs> huh. They had a good thing going here. Can we stay here? We'll see. No one's here. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. 
I'm here, kiddo. I know. Are you saying I'm not someone? That's not what I mean. Just a few. Remember what we said? You know this. Never, Never hesitate. That's right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something we can eat. Hope so. You good? Uh-huh. Just hungry. Grumbly and your tumbly? <laughs> no, just regular hungry. Not the worst place to sleep. We didn't see a kid. No, no, we didn't. Might be why they gave up. <sighs> Spoiled. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. I'm in shoot. Look. Huh. Nothing good back that way. Gotta keep searching in here. Something under here. Floor door? Huh, yeah. I must have wanted to hide something. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. It's rigged! <laughs> AJ! Oh, shoot. Okay, we need to get back to the car. You know what to do. Stick to the sides and be my eyes while I clear a path.
Sometimes I don't know the reason why So I guess I'll keep gambling Lots of moves and lots of rambling Well, it's easier than just a waiting around to die PJ! will do. Where the hell am I?
Don't move. Stay where you are. Don't turn around. Put down the knife. How about you do the same? We're not gonna hurt you. We've got your boy, he's safe. I'll take you to see him. Just put down the knife. Your turn. See? We're not gonna hurt you. I'm Marlon. The little guy's Tennessee. Ten, for short. He's the one been taking care of you. He, uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You gotta take precautions, you know, just in case. No need to explain. Like you said, I was in pretty rough shape. Yeah, to say the least. It must have been tough out there for the both of you. Anyway, I didn't mean to scare you. Just being cautious. Sorry if it came across the wrong way. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. Come on, let's go see your boy. You've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? Don't usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. It's taken its toll. Been making a lot of mistakes lately. You saw the car. Don't be so hard on yourself. You lived, didn't you? Good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. You had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. I've seen some rough scenes. But that one would have been up there. Uh, hi there? What's his problem? You're just new. We haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well... I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but... We do alright for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses. Good location, too. No one really comes out this way anymore. We've carved ourselves the perfect camp. Kids are safe here. We make sure of it. Huh. Only kids. That actually sounds kind of awesome. You think so? I, mean, I like it myself, but I'm probably a little biased. It wasn't always like this, though. There uh, used to be a lot of us, but... You know how it goes. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit troubled. 
You got me and AJ all wrong, Marlin. A couple of pure angels. <laughs> Jury's still out on you, but an angel your boy is decidedly not. It's been a little terror since he arrived. <laughs> Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. Think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Get a move on, Willie! And where's your damn weapon? this place. like it's coming from this floor.
I'm Lewis. Clementine. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. this one. 